The first choice is the 42nd President of the United States. He was President from 1993 to 2001, so in the 21st century, and we're talking about Mr. Bill Clinton. Now, Clinton left office with the highest end of office approval ranking of any U.S. president since World War II. This is including, basically, the Monica, Monica Lewinsky kind of thing which happened, and has continually received high scores in historical rankings of U.S. presidents. There's your first choice. The next one, the 43rd President of the United States, from January 20, 2001 to January 20, 2009, was, of course, W. Walker Bush, George W. Bush. Now, Bush was among the most popular, as well as the unpopular, U.S. presidents in history. He received the highest recorded approval ratings in the wake of the 9-11 attacks. But one of the lowest ratings during the 2000 financial crisis. Choice number two. The 44th President of the United States from 2009 until 2017, January of both years, was Barack Obama. Obama's presidency was generally regarded favourable and evaluations of his presidency among historians, political scientists and the general public made him among the upper tier of American presidents. He left when Donald Trump took over but he continues to reside or live in Washington DC. That is your third choice. And your final choice is the 45th President of the United States, Mr. Donald Trump, January the 20th, 2017, until the present day. Where do we start? Well, Donald Trump said that he wanted to drain the swamp. Well, he certainly drained something. And I think... Instead of me giving you a rundown of what he's done, good and bad, in different people's point of view or in their eyesight, you can go to places like CNN, BBC, Fox News, whatever, and you can find that. Some examples that I could say, he started off his presidency with an order on travel bans on several Muslim-majority countries. He enacted tax cuts packages for individuals and businesses, something related to the health insurance mandate, things about him going to court all the time, the withdrawal of the Trans-Pacific Partnership, the withdrawal on the Paris Agreement and the Iran nuclear deal. The list goes on. Is he the best president so far of the 21st century? That is choice number four. So, which one do you think it is? Is it Bill Clinton? Is it George W. Bush? Is it Barack Obama? Or is it, our, is it the present president of the United States, Mr. Donald Trump? Have a wonderful day. Be good to each other. Bye-bye.